We want to compare these four integers. What we're going to do is we're going to first kind of place them on a number line. So here's our number line. And we could put zero anywhere we want. So I'll put zero oh, right here just to be a little bit different. Zero doesn't always have to be right in the middle. And then two would be right there. And negative one, two, three, negative three, negative four, negative five would be right there. So now we know the order. Negative five is the smallest number. Negative three <clears throat> is the next smallest number. Zero, and then two is the greatest number. So two is the largest, negative five is the smallest. Anything to the right on the number line is larger than anything on the left. For example, if I wanted to say negative three and negative five, how do they compare? Well, negative three is greater than negative five, so we would use this symbol. Negative three is greater than negative five. If I wanted to say, uh, how does negative five and zero compare? I would say well, negative five is less than zero, and the symbol would look like this. You can imagine this to be an alligator mouth, and the alligator mouth is always eating the bigger number.